The Ghanaian vice president says, because the social economic challenges facing both countries are similar, they need to share ideas on how best to find solutions. He noted that Ghana is moving away from foreign aid dependency and modernizing its economy to attract foreign direct investment and increasing trade. I think the economic challenges that our respective countries are trying to solve are very common. I mean, I'm sure the issue of youth unemployment is a big issue for you as it is for us. I'm sure housing <coughs> it's a big issue for you as it is for us. Industrialization, the great sector, there are various things that I think in, in common we can think and share our respective experiences in dealing with these particular problems. I think so we have probably more to learn from each other uh, than, than you know, for us and other countries who will not share those types of experiences. Baumi has stressed the need to improve inter-African trade, which can only be of benefit to the continent. He further applauded Namibia for being one of the few African countries to export fish and meat products to the U.S., Europe and China. Ghana also has an abundance of tropical fruit and vegetables for export to Namibia. So I think that these interactions between <coughs> Uh, two countries, uh, it's clear there are a lot of opportunities um, for, for people in Ghana here. There are a lot of crops that grow here that we not grow in Namibia. And that is an export opportunity. There are other export opportunities from Namibia to Ghana. Uh, and, 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 and I think that we should, we should really, uh, sometimes we don't realize that uh, the markets are closer within the continent than, than we, we expect whenever we think about exporting. We, we are psychologically attuned to think Europe, America, China. We don't really think what should be intra-African trade. And a lot of the times the markets are, are much more um, accessible. The two countries will soon sign a new permanent joint commission on cooperation, which is the third of its kind. The Namibian delegation returns home at the end of the week.